Good afternoon everyone. Today we are with Dr. Surendra Jain sir. He is Director of Toba Institute of Pharmacy, Bhopal. Sir, welcome to Thoughts on Education interview program of collegedunia.com. Thank, Thank you very much. much. Uh, sir, please introduce yourself. Uh, myself, Dr. Surendra Jain, uh, Master of Pharmacy in PhD in Pharmaceutical Sciences. I am having 26 years of uh, total teaching and research and administrative experience. Right now I am working as a Professor and Director of Toba Institute of Pharmacy, Bhopal. Sir, you have held key position at Education Institute. Yes. So, what keeps you connected with the education sector and how is your experience so far with the institute? Uh, actually, I have been keen interest in uh, uh, teaching uh, innovations and research that keep me in this particular profession. I am working since last six, 26 years on different positions mm -hmm. like uh, lecturer, assistant professor, associate professor, and professor and director. So, my basic interest is in teaching and the guiding students working as a manager that me that motivated me to work sir being the director uh, what is your philosophy of leadership uh, leadership uh, is a fundamental principle in which uh, we have to work in a form of team we cannot dictate our uh, team members we should work along with them that will uh, finally come into leadership Sir, uh, the education system in India and uh, other foreign countries are structured very differently. Mm -hmm. So, in your experience, uh, what can you say, what can an inbound student gain from studying here in your institute? Actually, we, we are bound to the university system that is uh, with uh, us only. We are bound to university of uh, technology of Madhya Pradesh. And we cannot work uh, beyond their syllabus, beyond their writing library. So, we have to go through their moment. Sir, how does the curriculum of your institute ensure that it is the best practice of industry? Uh, our curriculum is based and given by Pharmacy Council of India and on the basis of Rajiv Gandhi Technical University. So we cannot do uh, much innovation in that particular uh, in that particular field. So whatever whatever syllabus given by Pharmacy Council of India and Rajiv Gandhi Technical University, you have to follow that particular syllabus and the syllabus is industry oriented only. Sir, any insight into how your institute could be more welcoming to students of different races or economic backgrounds? We welcome uh, different races and different uh, economically background uh, students from all over the India. Uh, in our institute, all kind of students are uh, studying on uh, every caste, every fraternity of students are working, uh, studying, even though Jammu Kashmir students are, are also studying in Truman Institute of Arts. Sir, uh, what do you think your roles and responsibility towards the student as well as towards the institute are? My roles and responsibility towards a student is to make them a good human being, a good uh, citizen of our in India and it would be uh, very nice pharmacy professionals and towards institute that our our our, history, our students and our institute will grow like anything. Sir, uh, what would you like people to know about uh, Truba Institute of Pharmacy that they may not know? Truba Institute of Pharmacy is uh, approved and accredited by National Board of Accreditation. This year we have conducted that uh, inspection and uh, our approval letter has already arrived. So, National Board of Accreditation is a recognition body at of national importance and after recognition of this uh, National Board of Accreditation, our institute is having a different kind of uh, uh, paradigm shift in development. Sir, uh, what do you see as the greatest strength of Truva Institute of Pharmacy? For a student. For a student. Sir, any suggestion you would like to give to the current youth and the aspiring students? We should uh, work uh, tirelessly, we should work hard and we should be focused enough so that we can go uh, to achieve our goals uh, in a timeless manner. Thank you so much sir, thank you for giving some time to us.